Hello. I hope you're having a good day. You want to do your Christmas cards, right? Well, you have to do your Christmas cards, right? I don't like writing anything by hand, so if I have the choice, I'll have a computer do it. But printers are Satan's tool. Let me show you a handful of things that I figured out by uh, trial and error that uh, hopefully you can just follow along. First things first, we're going to learn how your printer works. To begin with, you're going to take a regular sheet of paper, we're going to draw an arrow on it. Say hello to my trusty HP LaserJet 4050. I will open up the front of it, pull out the tray, spread these out, and this is what this key file is for. This goes into the printer, that side up. Okay, what you see here is LibreOffice Writer. It's an open source, literally for free, word processing uh, program. It is currently set to its defaults, which is, if I recall, we'll go to Format and find out. Format, page style, page, letter, eight and a half by 11. And that's orientated to portrait. But the, when we're printing out envelopes, usually you print them sideways. So I'm going to set mine to landscape and hit apply and then OK. So now my page is quote unquote sideways. I will then hit print. We're going to hit this OK. It's going to send it out to my printer. This is what I'm going to get, and this will help me orient my envelopes. Let's move on to the next step. So now I have retrieved my Christmas card. So we got seven and a quarter by five and a quarter. So keep that in the back of your head, seven and a quarter by five and a quarter. Now that we have the measurements we need, we have two places, two places, two places we need to make these adjustments. Place number one is in the sheet layout. In LibreOffice, that's in format page style. Now remember, this is on the landscape setting. One of these may match, but I went through them and I couldn't find one that matched. So honestly, I just thought it was easier to make myself a custom or a user defined sizing. 7.25 by 5.25 and you hit tab to go to the next measurement. So as you can see we have a very envelope sized sheet of paper here which is custom. I think you can save this but I'm not going to worry about that. Apply. Okay. So what do you think would happen if you hit print at this point? Would it work? No, it wouldn't. We're going to come to printer settings. You can either do that through the dialog here or if you're running some sort of Windows OS you click on your start menu and you can type print. I'm probably sure there's a way to find it but this is the easiest way I found to do it. So we're going to go into printers. I'm going to use my ancient 2008 HP LaserJet 4050 and we're going to go to manage. So we're going to go to printing preferences. Paper sizes. Every printer is going to be a little bit different, but I'm going to show you this one. It should give you a relatively good idea of where you need to go. Paper sizes letter. Click on a button that says custom or find a way to manually define a uh, paper size. I'm going to go custom. 7.25 and my width was 5.25. We're going to do video. I'm going to print off the video and put it in the envelope. So now I got paper size and because like I said printers are evil you need to hunt down the size you made and often it will be not here. Okay uh, where did my where did my thing go? Perfect. 
Oh no, they, okay. What happened is, is you have to go out of the utility and come back in. Y'all thought I was kidding when I said printers are evil. But anywho, it will save, even though it may not look like it's saved, but it's saved. So we got 0002, video envelope, pressers envelope, pick one. This should say five and a half by seven and a half, whatever dimensions you defined. Hit apply and hit OK. Minimize that, come to this, and let's take a risk. We're going to take a risk. We're going to take this envelope here. And we're going to put it through without testing on another sheet of paper first. Let's see if this works. Okay. So, all right. Take your envelope. Got your envelope here, right? Many printers have these little sliding guides. Slide them in so they're just barely touching the sides of the envelope by hair. Push it in. And if your printer has an option for defining what tray it goes through, select it. If your printer just automatically decides, we'll see. Not automatically decides. I told it to automatically select paper source. I'm going to come over here, hit the printer icon or control P. 7.25 user defined by 5.25. Looks like this, looks like this. HP laser jet paper size haha -ha, you see look at it this sucker's trying to trip us up so we're gonna come down and we're gonna find one of our user defined sizes see it's trying to get you and then we're gonna hit okay isn't that beautiful isn't that gorgeous isn't that wonderful okay. so now we figure out what we did Orientation, automatic, landscape. You gotta catch it. Go into the comments right now and tell me whether or not you think it's gonna work this time. Okay. Printing. Off it goes. There we go, and it works. See how easy it is? You too can save yourself a bunch of handwriting by just simply <laughs> setting your computer up to print the envelopes out for you. Just gotta make sure, I mean, not seriously though, seriously, I mean, all jokes aside, just gotta make sure you check both the word processor and the printer settings. And you gotta make sure they match because at least with my system, you have to do that manually. Well, that's about all she wrote for today. Uh, please like, subscribe, mash that bell, and all the other fun YouTuber stuff. But most importantly, most importantly, I hope you learned something. Honestly, I learned something by doing this video. I thought I knew exactly what to do by this point. Take care. Merry Christmas. Happy Holidays.